pledge of allegiance. Pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, and liberty and justice. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the Village of Washington, Bill. Uh, regular board meeting today, Tuesday, August 20th. Just a few announcements. Um, our paving project of Decker, Smith Court, and Hayes uh, will begin on Tuesday, September 3rd with the milling of the road. Paving will begin Monday, September 16th. If you are traveling up that road right now, you're going to see a lot of work being done by our Department of Public Works. They're replacing catch basins or manholes or whatever people access points. I forget they changed the name, they're not manholes anymore. Um, curving has been completed. So well on the way, um, had to go off to the DPW. I know we're stretching them in all different directions. Um, we do, I do apologize for that, and I'm sure the board feels the same way. Our fountain uh, project has begun. The uh, Fountain in Memorial Park has been installed and is running. It runs from the hours of 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. Uh, we're looking to have Ahern completed within the next uh, two weeks. Going down to our SBR, our wastewater treatment plant, the SBR tank will be started by next week's end, which will allow us to shut down one side of the plant and complete phase two. We are right now 80% complete on that project. Uh, we have prayer in Vern Allen Park this Sunday, something that a uh, resident had asked me last year to start. Uh, we have a couple of uh, pastors, priests, uh, hopefully a lot of residents coming in to pray for uh, our community, our communities. If any resident would share their concerns over the cleanliness of our village, please do not have any concerns over the cleanliness of our village. Please do not hesitate to call me at 496-3221, Village Hall of my direct line at 496-2555. Uh, we still have some potholes that need to get fixed up. Like I said, we are working on them. Uh, we're going to be uh, putting traffic barrels uh, up and down Ahern. Uh, up and down, I'm sorry, up and down uh, Decker, because there is a low time between the time that the milling's being done and the streets being paved. Uh, we had some theft, I guess, with cones uh, over the manholes last month, was it? Did we ever find, we found some, I believe, right? But there's still some out there. So if you see anyone that has a cone that really doesn't really don't think should have them, please call us. We are working on updating our website. Uh, we, I sat down with the webmaster this week, and uh, our website is going to be um, ADA accessible. Our website's going that way right now, so now's a good time for us to uh, take our website, have it in multiple languages, I guess one of the hardest things with a website is keeping up with the website. So we have to make sure that we uh, are cognizant of that. Uh, that's pretty much it on the announcements. Uh, new business, employment, uh, clerical assistant, village hall. Um, Sophia uh, Foley. Student will be able to give us uh, at least every other day. I'm hoping every day on a uh, work study program. Facility use request, Washingtonville friends and neighbors, village yard sale. 
October 5th, 2019, with the rain date of October 6th. Uh, use of Vernal and Fog for uh, Village Yard Sale with tables, with table fees going to food for kids. Uh, this was done last year. Worked out very well. Uh, again, residents coming forward wanting to use our, our park. October 5th, I believe, is a Saturday. Uh, Saturday. Saturday. Mm -hmm. Did it come on the last year? Uh, it, it, we would put it on the village event, so it's up to us, uh, which, which will bring me up to my next thing after that, which is okay. uh, I'd like to make a motion on it. I'll second. Trustee Cole? Yes. Trustee Cole? Yes. Okay. Uh, last month, I, I know I was in here for the work session, but we were discussing the dog parade. Yes. Okay. I spoke with uh, Will Frank today, and uh, facilities use requests would need to be done. I have a notify our insurance carrier. Uh, village has insurance again. Would be part of uh, the village. I believe they went from Memorial Park last year down to Burn Allen. They were over. I want to say close to 100 dogs, but maybe not that many. Dogs have a good time. Yeah. Uh, so I know uh, Trustee Lodato wanted to bring it up today. She's not able to be here tonight. Uh, Trust, uh, Deputy Mayor Lang is on his way. So we want to make a motion on, on that. With any, any what day did you want to Do you have the date on that? It was November. It was, I, we can check. It was whatever was brought up at the two meetings. Do you have the date? Third. Third. Saturday. November 3rd. Saturday night. Okay. Uh, and Veterans Day is the following Saturday, I believe. As long as they're under our insurance. One thing I did not, uh, I forgot to announce, on Saturday, Chief I was, spoke to you today about the, the run for, uh, was that next week? I think it's next Saturday. <coughs> yeah, next Saturday, um, the food pantry uh, wants to have a run from, uh, I want to say from the food pantry down to Burn Allen, starting at 9 o'clock in the morning. Uh, that time is... Not correct. I will get that time out. Uh, it's to raise money for uh, a freezer that they are in dire need of at the food pantry. Uh, they get a lot of uh, frozen food donated from various supermarkets in the area. Uh, they don't have a place to store it, so they want to raise money for for that. So if you're into running for an hour. I will, be at the, I will be at the end, I'll throw water on me, so people think I'm that fast. And uh, I don't trust Deputy Mayor Lang will be on my side, hopefully not on my back. And um, I'll be in the donuts. You'll be in the donuts. Do the donuts on this? Uh, they are going to. Have. And it's this Saturday? No, it's next Saturday, okay. the 31st. So you can get you on that? Yes. Can you come up down to us there? But well, they're running in the street. I don't really know if we 
This time, um, we have any comments from the public? Sure. Please um, say your name and address. Christy Johnson, 11 Amy Road. Um, I just wanted to let everyone know that the Hudson Valley Girl Scouts Local Troop 317 has placed school supplies in the Round Hill Little Library that are available for anyone to just come and pick up. So, um, and we have to refill, so please. Um, and you know whoever needs take advantage of that. When is that available? Now. Yeah. Well, thank you. At the Round Hill, a little uh, during the day. Um, whenever. Uh, during the day, preferably. But there's somebody there now. I'm going to say it's, no, no, it's, 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 it's inside the the little library. It's 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 here. Oh, it's inside. Right, the little, just like oh, 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 oh. but it's in front of Round Hill. When you said just, okay, yeah, right. I got it. Whenever you can. Thank you. Uh, one other one now, and, and, and I'm sorry. No, okay. um, I was notified today that they placed a uh, meter on the Locust Street Bridge of the creek that would, would sound an alarm if there were reaching uh, heights that were in danger of flooding. Installed, I believe, last Friday. Uh, I will get more information out to the public as soon as uh, they give me the yeah, that information. But it was installed on Locust Street Bridge as well as the uh, by the Blooming Grove Town Hall. It's going to make phone calls to emergency services. Uh, Chief, I need your home number. Uh, figured you'd like that. Yeah, sure. Uh, yeah, Chris should know. Chris's home number. Uh, and cell number. So in case you're at home, they go to just cell. Uh, uh, as soon as I get that information, I will forward that uh, via Facebook, which will then coordinate with website. The only thing I know is they installed it. Uh, Kelly Morris from Orange County will be out here tomorrow if you want to join us. Uh, tender. I don't know if it's hanging, if it's on the stick. So I know I did some kind of conduit. Same kind of just sticking up on the side of the bridge. You know more than What's that? Pass by them. Uh, in your packet, I gave uh, information on professional services agreement for a Delaware uh, engineer. Please, please. Are you through. still doing the public comment? Yes, we are. Uh, and you're always curious. Okay. Sorry. Uh, we'll continue with public comment. 
you know, I just, um, I had a fairly major issue. I uh, just came back, uh, appropriately enough, taking care of my disabled war veteran son, who uh, wanted to have nothing to do with Washingtonville ever since he came back from Afghanistan <coughs> with uh, you know, water shells in his uh, leg. Um, I got back on a Tuesday, and on a Thursday, I was just leaving the house when two people came up from, quote, mobile mental health and asked whether I had water or electricity in my house, which I assume was just plain bullshit. Obviously, I had water and electricity in my house. And when I called up their supervisor, they indicated Mayor Joe Bucco and the fire inspector evidently had indicated some reason why. Um, I've contacted a lawyer on this, so, but at a minimum, I want to know, you know why this occurred. I hadn't even been here for two months. I was down in Virginia helping my son and daughter. So I came back on a Tuesday, 